Hey, what's up everyone? Brian with you from the Game Company. We are playing some more Frostpunk, continuing with our way home campaign, and about to get cold. It's about to get cold. Uh, Londoners are actually, they're abandoning cause. Our hope's doing pretty good right now. I mean, I think resources, I think everything's going really good. Um, our... Yeah, there we go. We were slightly rotated. Uh, our automaton is over here doing steel. Okay, so we're getting pretty efficient on steel. We, yeah, that's right, 99%. And what were you knocking out overdrive? It's been a couple days. So you're going to finish that up. And then I think we wanted to go grab the range upgrade. Yeah, and we'll be able to finish that in time. Yeah, I think I definitely want that range upgrade, too. We're definitely going to have to overdrive, I think. We don't have any extra people right now. That's fine. It's free time. We might as well go speed three because it's nighttime. We should see some Londoners drop tonight. Um, simply because... Does this change? Like, does it look different now? I feel like it looks different now. Huh. Interesting. Uh, another act of vandalism. The Londoners have to face more walls. Okay, send a cleric. Hope will uh, fall slightly. Once again, we can't send the police because, you know, that's a pretty nasty fall too. still. Um, we can't raise it. We can't do any of the messages or anything like that, so that's fine. Um, still, still, we should have less Londoners. What? A cleric has been beaten? Oh, my God. Captain, a priest was assaulted while trying to reassure people disturbed by the Londoners' slogan. We should do something to protect our people. You'll have three days to establish the faith keepers. We need the faith keepers to strike back. Hope will rise slightly, discontent will fall slightly. Screw it. We're gonna get the faith keepers. You brought this on yourself, people. I wanted to be nice. I wasn't gonna be super uh, mean with our religion, but guess what? You brought it on yourself. We're now gonna force you to stay in line. We're gonna have, we're gonna militarize the faith, which has never been a problem in history or in literature. Nope, never, never. Feels a little bit like Game of Thrones, actually. What were they? They weren't the faith keepers. Were they the faith keepers? No. I'm trying to think, what were they called in Game of Thrones? Huh. I don't think it was the Faith Keepers. Overdrive, coupling, research, yeah. Took long enough, so give me the range upgrade. It's gonna finish just in time. What are we looking like here? Oh yeah, that's looking sexy. I like it, I like it. We definitely still need, weren't we building a, yeah we did. Oh, that's a shrine, Never mind. I thought we built some power out here. Yeah, weren't we gonna build a heater out here? I should probably get a heater out of here. Hi, babe. Hi. Is the dog alone? Outside? Outside. Oh my gosh. Have fun drying her. I don't want to wash her. She's all muddy. Oh. I'll help you when I'm done with this episode. Oh. Uh, 20 minutes? <laughs> uh, we're going to put a pause in this episode. I'll be back in a second. Can I just say, oh my God. <laughs> so she was like digging. Uh, she was digging inside a puddle in the ground. So she was so muddy, which I posted a picture probably on Twitter a couple days ago. But anyways, what were we doing? We were uh, doing something. I don't know. Let's just advance time because I don't remember where we were. Uh, oh, yeah. We were getting the faith people, the, the faith people to like beat people up. Um, but then the other thing is I think we wanted a steam hub over here. Maybe I accidentally built the shrine instead of the steam hub. That might have actually happened. Or were we still waiting on it? We might have still been waiting on it. I don't know if we're gonna need this. I could have sworn we built one over here. Could have sworn I built one. I think I accidentally built a shrine, maybe. Maybe, I don't know. How many shrines do we have? Because we needed three shrines, correct? There's no way to look there. How do we see what shrines are? Whatever, whatever. Just pop out the steam hub. Or maybe we didn't have enough steel. Maybe that was it. I don't know. Something along those lines. Do we care about that hunter's hut? Eh, I'm going to say no. So I'm just going to build it there. Um, I think it uses just straight steel, which is fine. Uh, I like keeping the buildings rotated in the same direction just so we kind of remember where everything is. I think all of our houses were done, correct? Bunk houses. Was there anything else? No, we still needed a few more. Um... Screw it. Just go knock them all out. Let's just finish all that up. 
And I think we're good to go. Uh, we're knocking out the remainder of the food. We can go have those guys help build here in a little bit, but I'm not super concerned about that. They're finishing that. I still don't quite get like who actually does the building, but sure. Sure. So with all the bunk houses, we should be pretty well ready to go for this next uh, drop. Yeah, I think things are going to be fine there. 108% efficiency? How's that happening? I have no idea. So generator range upgrade. Nice. Um, we could do steam hub range upgrade, which might not be a bad option. Uh, wait, they have an actual... Yeah, it has a range setting. So we don't necessarily want that because I'm assuming that's going to require more coal, correct? Uh, consume twice as much coal. Yeah, so I'd rather not do that. The heaters, they'll use more coal per hour. So I think we'd rather get resource stuff. So the Steamworks buildings are just straight better <coughs> from everything I read. Um... Steam coal thumper, large resource. So we have coal mining. We don't get the steam coal mine until the next level. How is our wood? Our wood is really fine. The steam steelwork sounds pretty decent. Flying hunters also sounds good to get more food. But uh, now let's do healthcare insulation. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, just because more insulation is always, I think, a great thing for us to have. What was the other thing? Cookhouse insulation. Eh, our cookhouse is, like, in a really good spot, so I'm not super worried about that. Okay. Change of heart. Sir, a man was found currently crying silently in the temple. We approached him to ask if he needed help. He told, it, told us he wanted to see you. I thought my faith died long ago, sir, with my wife and daughters in London. I couldn't see any purpose in new life in the fight of survival. But today, when I entered the temple, I saw the future for us. Now I'm ready to face it. Boom. Yeah. Yeah, we made good decisions. We made a good decision, man. We made a good decision. Um, they're probably not going to be as friendly when we build faith keepers who go around beating people up, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Mm. 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 Let's put them to zero. Let's let them hopefully go work on some building. I don't know. I don't know if we really need the gathering post right now. I'm not as concerned with that. I think I'd rather just have them build. I don't know if the extras build. We still honestly have no idea, but it's fine. Are we going to get more people here? They're going to what? Winterholm. I don't think there are people in Winterholm, if I remember. Yeah, I don't think there are, but it's been a long time since I saw the game played. Cole is looking great, but Cole's going to get really bad here pretty quick. So the more coal, the better right now. What are we making per day? Let's just roll through stats. We're losing more coal than we're gaining, huh? Huh? But why? He asked himself. Maybe because of the, the, the steam generator? Yeah, I don't know. Can I just, like, auto-toggle all the heaters? That would just be nice. Um. Dude, those churches, man, have really good heat generation. Like, he's comfortable. Which is kind of great. So, um, I don't know why we're losing coal all of a sudden today. Because we've been making ridiculous amounts of coal. So what would have changed... What would have changed? We still have all the people working there. Uh, what's happening over here with the thumper? You're doing 67, and then both these gathering posts are working at full efficiency. Yeah, they're 100% efficiency. Huh. So I'm not quite sure why we're losing coal today. Because we can even look here. Yesterday, why did our use go up so much? today from yesterday did we oh not seem of ah okay so the range setting went up that's what happened yeah it's on range two so when we completed the range setting it immediately popped it up to size two um i think it's okay yeah, we'll go to one for now. 
Because my plan is mostly the overdrive. Yeah, now we're making an extra 200 per day. Okay, I, I just want to bank as much as possible until tomorrow. So then the question really becomes, and actually it's not even a question. I'm going to go ahead and drop all you guys. Get rid of the automaton. Let's go with the engineers over here. And then I want the automaton there. I want the automaton working on the uh, coal 24-7. Just because we're going to want as much coal as possible popping out. So just being able... I know we're not going to make as much during the day, but I just need as much coal as possible. We could even potentially do a gathering hut over here. And I'm not opposed to that either. And we can go ahead and have the cookhouse people work there over here when we're done. I think I like that. So resources, give me a gathering post. We'll do something like that. It doesn't really matter right now because we're probably going to end up trashing it eventually. And then you just go like that. And so then once this gets built, then we're going to have uh, the cookhouse people go work over there. Okay, all our houses are ready to go. Uh, Double check on it. Bunk houses. There's nothing to upgrade. Uh, I think we have like an extra 10 houses. Healthcare is looking great right now. And in fact, we could dump some people. Um, Because we only have like one patient there. We have no patients there. So we might as well just like shut this down for the time being. Uh, do we have the energy? Hold operation. The heater is off. Okay. We're probably going to need the people though. Yeah, we're gonna need the people here in a little bit. Like when the temp drops, I'm pretty sure then these are gonna get filled up. So we just gotta kinda remember where we have people. But for now, I'm gonna go throw them over here in the coal mining. Once again, like let's just bank as much coal as possible. And then we'll go from there. Um, It is evening, so we might as well do this. We have four sick. Okay, so how are we out of... I don't understand how we just like get rid of them immediately we have issues. Temple of Influence, some people to mend their ways good where londoners have dropped again uh speaking of which no we can't do anything yet two of our people died all right so we should just never <laughs> close the medical places my gosh like every time i close the medical place it's like oh someone died like what we'll put you there because it's free time so it's not like they're doing anything you're done here you're gonna go gather all of that I don't know we actually care about the steel, so I'm just going to go over here and just have these guys go max out the coal. We'll do five and three. We'll do that for now. And then we'll put you guys over here, I think. All right. Candles for the wicked. Sir, people are no longer troubled by Lunder's slogan. Group prayers have strengthened our community. Small candles keep appearing under the slogan. People leave them when they pray for the souls of the Londoners. I'm glad to hear that. So that means we don't have to send our dudes to engage them anymore. Book of Laws. We want purpose and guess what time it is. It is Faith Keeper time. So Faith Keepers, new ability, nighttime, reduce discontent. You'll have to build the seat of the Faith, can, uh, faith Keepers. Discontent will rise. Okay. Where are we going to build the Faith Keepers? Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. I want to look at this building. Uh, faith Keepers. They maintain order, lowering discontent in the whole city. They can organize processions and reduce it further. There can only be one base level two. So let's put it over here by the temple. We can double up the buildings here. Actually, you know what? Let's just put it right there. Sure. 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 Uh, any messages, sermons, or anything like that? Yes. Evening prayers. What's our food? Food's looking good. So we will do evening prayers. Hope will rise. Boom. Where's our other one? We will do a sermon over there. Boom. Let's go. Make my people like it. It's a middle of the night sermon, but whatever. And we're at Winterholm. Okay, we climbed to the edge of the city. We stood there speechless, staring at the scene of devastation. It's a city of the dead. Most of the buildings are destroyed. The generator has exploded. We might get a steam core. Okay, search the area. Uh, the streets of the ruined city are littered with scores of dead bodies. The city chronicle describes the shortage of food and citizens increasing despair, the following squabbles, riots, and descent into anarchy, fights, and dwindling resources, and the eventual starvation. The last entry, God forgive us, we're eating our dead. There's no hope. We get two steam cores. That's probably going to lower hope, though. Coal mine, snow cliff. Oh, no, no, no. We got one over here at the American camp. Well, let's go do the snow cliff while we're over here, and then we'll send them home. I don't really care if we lose these steam cores as much. Um, we do need to get the automation going. Yeah, here goes the drop. 
First Londoners convinced to stay. Hey, several of the people who wanted to flee have decided to trust you. Really? Because it's actually been going down for a while. All right. That's good. Totally just ignore the fact that, you know, Winter Home crashed and everyone hates, you know, life. But okay, that's cool. That's cool. Um, We hadn't got the drop yet. There is a drop. Buckle it up. It's getting colder. Uh, so it's too cold. How long do you think we can run this in overdrive? Oh, that overdrive is crazy good. Nice. Nice. Okay. Uh, very cold. I'm gonna have to crank you on. I'm gonna crank you. On. Oh, you're already on. Ugh. Freezing. So we're gonna need. Coal mine doesn't matter. We might just need people not to work in some of these buildings. Yeah. Low risk of becoming gravely ill. Small risk, high risk of getting ill. Small risk of requiring an amputation. We might just need to button down the hatch and just not let people work in these cold areas right now. It's only two days. <clears throat> What else are we going to have them do? Pfft. Not get sick? Yeah, probably. I need coal. Okay. Okay. Dump you. Dump you. Dump you. Dump you. Dump you. We're not going to be gaining any wood for now, but that's okay. And what is this one? Dump you. I just, I can't risk it. I I think it's just going to be a problem. I think people just, it's too easy for them to get sick. What about the range upgrade? Do you think that would help? Alright, well, let's see. What, is, what are we looking at right now? Coal balance is still positive. So what if we cranked you up to range 2 on overdrive? Then what does that look like? We can turn you off. That really doesn't help. <laughs> yeah, really doesn't help. Uh, we can turn you off because we removed people from working there. Same thing here. We don't have people working there, so if we don't have people working there, we don't need to run them. The question is, public house being very cold kind of sucks. I think I need one more... What is that under? Tech? I can't do another steam hub because we don't have 20 steel. Fudge. Yeah, I really want another steam hub. Hmm. So we're still getting coal over here. We have 48 people, man. Do I send the automaton to go get a steel so we can get up to 20? I, I think we have to. I think we have to. Um, I think coal is actually probably still okay at this point. We'll go free time for now, uh, or we'll just run it for the time being. So no one's actually working here. I, I, that's fine. I don't really care. Oh my god, we're losing 500 a day. Shoot. So we are going to need more coal. Now, nah. screw the steel, man. We need the coal. I might have to work, people. I might have to work, people. You know what? Let's send everyone here. And I know they're probably going to freeze to death and get die, but, like, I think we got to risk it. I think we got to risk it temporarily. This is a bunkhouse. No one's living there, so that's fine. For the most part, we're not looking at anyone getting sick right now. So, healthcare insulation, boom. That's great. Our healthcare buildings look pretty dang good. Yeah, things okay there. Uh, 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 sorry. No, tech. What next? Infirmary, eh. Kill cost insulation, eh. We really want house insulation. But I think we have to get the next level. I don't think this is better... 
We don't actually even have the steel to do it. To research it. Gathering post insulation. Eating. I mean, we don't have the crap for any of this. We could do lighter scout sleds. Yeah, sure. That's fine. We'll do that. I, I was debating, like, oh, well, maybe we just turn the people off this one, then, since they're not doing anything, but I think this is okay. We're making a little bit of steel. The question is... I Here's the thing I'm not sure. If I put a steam hub over here, are we going to be able to work here? I don't know. I don't know if it generates enough heat for this. So it might just be worthless. Well, okay, we got this right here. You're a steam hub, and then you're level one, right? And you're livable. So, sure. Although this one is chilly. I think at worst case, it's probably chilly. So I think that's fine. Yeah, I think we're gonna be okay. We just gotta hope that these people don't get super sick. I think only having a couple people working is probably okay at this point. The biggest issue is, what are we looking like? We're actually making it. That's fine. That's totally acceptable. How's food? I don't care about that. I want food. We're making food. Life is great. Okay, so yeah, we can totally maintain right now then. Um, the only issue is the overdrive isn't going to be able to last the entire time. That's a problem. It's at 20%. Can it make it two days? <laughs> yeah. Uh, by the way, just for the hell of it, let's switch it back to the Celsius. We'll probably switch it back and forth. Just, you know, Europeans. Hey, now there you go. Just so everyone can kind of see. We saw it was negative 72. Now it's negative 60 Celsius. So now we all know what it's like. Although, let's be honest. I have no idea what negative 72 Fahrenheit's like, and I'm pretty sure most people don't know what negative 60 Celsius is. Um, unless you live in Canada. Coal pile depleted. You're supposed to actually be picking up the steel, by the way. Um, anywho. Steam hub. Knock that out there. Let's go ahead and remove all of you guys. Okay. Scouts have reached the snow cliff. Let's check this out real quick. The hole in the snow cliff leads to a small chamber. Someone lives here, but the lonely human figure we saw f uh, from afar has disappeared. It might be the sole survivor of Winterholm. Oh, uh, this seems bad. The refugee from Winterholm. The man we've seen from afar was nowhere to be found. Searching his burrow, we found a diary of a scientist who fled Winterholm. After the starving city fell into chaos, its leader and army captain appointed himself as absolute ruler. He tried to impose order using force. Plenty of people disgruntled, deserted the city, and most of the others rebelled against him. Take resources. Okay, sounds good. Shrouded Cave, Freshwater Spring. What are we looking at right now on resources? I think I'm gonna come home. Ah, I think I'm gonna come home with you. That's quite a bit of stuff right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the steam cores are gonna be very helpful because we need to get the factory going. Although we still got a little bit of time. So we were trying to see whether or not you were actually gonna be able to manage to keep these buildings going. If we did that and that. Yeah, these guys are great then. Well, you're not. But we can totally work here now for the steel. So let's go do that. Then hopefully that's gonna give us another steam core. How are we doing here? We're losing 200 a day. Off the one steam core and the one heater? That seems a little stupid, but I mean, it's only two days. We're, we're fine. 200 a day isn't a problem. Flare Scout says researched. Great. That was really cheap. Um, once again, I don't think there's anything we can actually research right now. 20, 20, 20, 10, 20, 10. Uh, we can do steam steelworks. Actually, that was one of the things we wanted, so I think I'm okay with that. Uh, cookhouse insulation, no. So, yeah, totally. Knock out the steelworks. Sweet. Now, the question is, do they have better heating? If they did, that would be great. But I don't know if they do. Okay, I gotta wrap this episode up here. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment. Let me know what you think, as always. Hit the subscribe button. Join the game. Comment, share your support. Next episode, we're gonna survive the rest of this deep winter, which right now, no one's even been getting sick. So, we're looking pretty good there. Uh, and then we're gonna get it back warmer, and we're gonna start building up our crap again. Wouldn't 
thing I think I'm gonna do while we have a surplus of people, let's go ahead and grab another... Uh, I need steel for that. We want another resource depot so we can start uh, banking some more coal. And in fact, I wonder, do you ha have any wood here? Man, man, I don't think it really works that way. Yeah, it doesn't really work that way. It just lowers it. Um, we have one for food, too, I think, if I remember correctly, which, yeah, yeah. So we're just going to have to build another one, but we're actually working and getting steel now, so that's good. And then, yeah, you're getting me my coal. Uh, one more time. We're only losing a couple hundred per day. That's fine. Food we're making per day, so that's actually great. And healthcare, no one's um, suffering. Uh, steel, we are making 48 a day. Good. Wood, we're not making any, but um, we're not really using wood right now. So anyways, I'll see you guys next episode. Later, everyone.